Building a strong doctor-patient relationship is essential for better patient's experience and satisfaction, and also for better communication, diagnostic accuracy, compliance to treatment, and overall outcome. Through this video, we are going to share with you a few ways to help you build a strong relationship with your patients. Build trouble by starting the conversation with introducing yourself and asking some general questions about your patient before asking medical questions. Show your thoughts through your body language. Keep an open posture, eye contact, smile, and if you are in a rush, make sure your patient will not feel or notice that. Pre-screen your patients before the appointment with the assistance of your front desk staff and check the information you have to avoid asking questions you already have its answers. Studies concluded that patients feel less satisfied when doctors use a screen during the appointment. Simply, you can share your screen with your patients if possible. This will help to increase the trust. Allow your patients to speak as much as possible and avoid interrupting them. So, you can make it like a discussion, not a series of questions and answers. Take care about your patient's emotions, encourage them to express their feelings, address their concerns, and make sure to show empathy and sympathy. Respect your patient's culture, beliefs, values, preferences, certainly this will affect their medical decisions. Anticipate what your patients need, this will certainly give them a message that you really care about them. Summarize what the patient said, this will be a good sign of active listening. Explain your actions, educating your patients will help you to build a strong doctor-patient relationship. Focus on the positives and the better outcome, instead of talking about the dangers of the negatives. Involve your patients in their management plan and practice chair decision-making. Get feedback from your patients and do your best to fulfill their requests and expectations. Follow up with your patients. Your task didn't finish with the end of the appointment. Try to be available for your patients as much as you can. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please click like, share and subscribe.